Hello, I'm Dr. John McDougall, and I'm the founder and director of the McDougall program. I've been uh, practicing this kind of medicine for over 35 years. I've been a licensed doctor for 42 years. Of all the foods that I would ask you to give up, it would be dairy first. Better chance of helping you and your family than giving up meat or making any other dietary change. The truth of the matter is, is these things are quite harmful. The dairy industry is in the business of selling something more toxic than tobacco or alcohol cause more serious problems to people's health than tobacco or alcohol, but don't expect them to change. The only way we're going to beat this is to get the truth out and to tell people that these are foods that aren't intended for people and can cause serious harm. I think it's the worst food that people eat for two reasons. One, the dairy is basically liquid meat. You know, everybody knows beet's bad, beef's bad. It's bad because it's full of fat and cholesterol and animal protein contamination. Well, if you look at uh, cheese, it has essentially the same macronutrients as, as a beefsteak does. You know, same amount of fat, same amount of cholesterol, same no dietary fiber, same lack of vitamin C, same contamination problems. They're basically liquid meat. Add to that the fact that the dairy protein has some unique qualities to it that hurt people even more. Like it's the number one cause of food allergy. And it also causes serious autoimmune diseases like rheumatoid arthritis, multiple sclerosis is probably involved with dairy products, uh, lupus, glomerulonephritis. So you've got these, these special qualities of the dairy protein. But I think probably the, the, the most important reason to hit hard on dairy is because so many people believe it's health food. They sit down to this block of yellow fat and they go, mmm, help my bones, mmm, help my bones. No. But with that in mind, if you were going to bargain with me and you were going to ask, what of the basic four food groups should I give up? Do you remember the old basic four food groups? Advertising dairy and meat and vegetables and fruits to you? An advertisement, by the way, usually put out by the dairy industry. If you bargained with me and you said, for my better health, for the health of my family, which of the four groups should I give up? Obviously, it wouldn't be the fruit and vegetable, would it? But when it came to the dairy of the meat group, I'd tell you, give up the dairy. Why? Because it has similar problems, as I showed you the macronutrient content, as the meat groups. But it has additional problems, such as the autoimmune and the allergy problems. But the biggest problem is that you believe it's health food. And so you eat it without guilt. And you feed it to your kids that way. And that's very wrong. So I hope I've given you a chance to rethink this. Not only are dairy products not necessary for your health and bones, they're also destructive to your family. And it may be the most difficult message for you to get because there's been so much education, so much effort, so much money putting behind trying to give you the other message. But I promise you that it will be the greatest benefit to you and your family if you can get this correct. You are not a cow. Your children are not calves. You should not be consuming cow's milk. It is a serious health hazard.